video I'll be doing my nighttime skincare routine. It is night right now. I just got finished uh, live streaming on TikTok, so I'd be getting ready to go to sleep anyways. So I thought I would just go ahead and record it for y'all. I'm always interested to see what people use on their skin. And I think I have a pretty good skincare routine right now, so maybe it'll be helpful for some of y'all. Before we begin today, I would like to thank today's sponsor, which is Dossier. Dossier is the best. Um, they create perfumes that are inspired by designer brands, and they now have their own fragrances as well. This is actually one of the Dossier original fragrances, so this is their own, and this is the Sage and Black Tea. I wanted to show y'all. Let's open up the box. So each one of their fragrances comes with a little note card. This tells you about the perfume and all of the notes, so the top, middle, and base notes. This one has top notes of star anise, bergamot, and cinnamon. Middle notes of violet, cardamom, clove, and tea. Base notes of sage, palo santo, and amorous wood. This is so nice. I think this is good for men and women, actually. I could see this being a really nice cologne and also just like spraying in the room. I'm gonna spray it. Dossier always has really good sales going on, so be sure to check the link in my description and check out the perfumes for yourself. Thank you so much, Dossier, for sponsoring today's video. And now let's get into my skincare. Okay, first, I'm gonna put my hair back with the scrunchie. This is like one of those satin scrunchies. I got this from Kitsch. I really like it. I like it because it doesn't really grease my hair. And then I use one of these um, just to hold my bangs, these little front pieces back. I know some of these things like come with wires in this part, but mine doesn't. Just wear it on top like that. Alright, so my first step, especially if I'm wearing makeup, which I am right now, is a little bit of cleansing water. I got this big one from Garnier a while ago, and I really like it. I do prefer Bioderma, the one with the pink bottle. This one was cheaper, I think, so I just got this one. And then usually I use like the reusable cloths. I got some on Amazon, but um, they're all dirty. I need to do my laundry, so I have these backup little cotton ovals. step is my cleanser. I use the Aveeno Calm and Restore Nourishing Oat Cleanser. I was trying to remember how long I've been using this. I think I've been using it for like about two years now. And I like it because it's super gentle and hydrating. It doesn't make my face feel like, you know, how your face can feel really tight after using some cleansers. This doesn't do that, and I really like it. I think it does a good job at cleansing as well. It does have a slight, like, oat smell, so if you don't like that, then maybe stay away from it. But honestly, it doesn't bother me. I kind of like it. I'm just going to wet my skin a little bit. Okay, and then I do about two pumps, so like that. And just gently into my skin. Making sure to get my makeup. And I like to really spend my time to massage this in. Just make sure that I'm getting any dirt, any makeup off. And then I'll go ahead and rinse. And then I go in with the toner. I really like this e.l.f. one. 
this is the elk skin beer skin toner and I think this actually does make a difference with how hydrated my skin feels I actually went without this for a couple weeks because I ran out and I was just busy and I felt like my skin was really dry and then I decided to buy this again and it just adds more hydration to the skin and I just put this all over with my hands my neck and then I started using this recently this is by Kiehl's it's the Kiehl's Clearly Corrective dark spot solution. It's kind of hard to see, but I started using this to help hopefully like clear up some acne spots and like dark spots that I have, like sunspots, and then um, I just have some scarring from when I broke out, so I haven't really seen too much of a difference, but I've been using this um, for maybe like two weeks. And I just focus on like my cheek area and then bring any other, or bring the rest of it like to the other parts of my face. Next, I use this serum. This is the Great Barrier Relief by Grave Beauty. I think I've been using this for maybe about two years now, and I just think it's like my skin loves it. It's super soothing. It says it's a reparative skin soothing treatment, and it's supposed to help like um, heal your skin barrier, especially if you're really dry or you stripped your skin barrier for whatever reason. I'm out of this, unfortunately. I just wanted to show y'all I have another one coming tomorrow. I ordered some more. Um, but it's just a really hydrating, like, soothing serum. Let's see if I can squeeze a little bit out. No, it's completely gone. And then I use prescription tretinoin. I have 0.05%, that's what they prescribe me, but honestly, I think it might be a little bit strong. Um, I just use like a pea size amount, maybe even smaller, but it, and use that to put all over my face, and I do this about every other night. I'm not gonna apply it tonight because I did it last night, and um, it just makes my skin dry, usually on the nights that I do it. Like, I find that the day after, I'm kind of like peeling in some areas. So, um, I don't want to overdo it, so I do it every other night, but I think this is really helpful and just helping with like fine lines. I, I don't know exactly like scientifically what it does. <laughs> I've read it before, but I forgot. But yeah, I definitely recommend this. of all time is the Embryolise. I like the sensitive version. The light cream sensitive. They have the original is like scented quite strongly so I just prefer this. I use this morning and night. This is a bit, like, heavy, I would say. Um, everyone's skin is different, so it might not work for everyone, obviously. Um, I remember when I was younger, I tried this, like, maybe early 20s, and I thought it was, like, a bit too heavy for me. But my 
steps that make me feel good so thank you all so much for watching